All right, this drive from work is going to be a little different. Um, prior ones I've done on a card by card basis, and this isn't against the cards that are coming out today. A uh, planet killer is a killer card. There was discussion on the thread forum uh, by Danny about how it's only Borg and Federation, but let's face it, if you're going up against a planet killer, it's going to be the Borg and Federation that'll do it. Uh, note that we're going here with a cunning option, not the throw people at him and hope that we just destroy the darn thing option. I imagine in the future we might get one that's more the latter, but this is more the intellectual former position. I'd also uh, like the explosion of Praxis, and gotta say, between the Planet Killer and the Praxis, it's a bit of an explosive day, uh, but they've got some good skills, and both missions have skills that you can use that are found in your affiliations, uh, that won't lead you in for agonizing experience. Uh, particularly the Planet Killer, which has a lot of cool ways to um, go about it. Skills that you probably have, but don't really pay too much attention to. You know, you're building your deck, you look at it, and then you're like, oh, wow, I've got a lot of skill overlap with this skill, and it's just two different skills that you need. What better more can you ask for? Uh, but also with Jessel. With Jessel, TNG and Relativity now both have an Archive Portrait card. And one of the goals of this set was to make sure that every affiliation had <laughs> a personnel in the Archive Portrait status. Uh, it was a little harder when you're doing just two cards per set, <laughs> but now that we're doing a 15 card set, we could have the last six I uh, give each affiliation something, whereas before each affiliation hasn't. Let me know in the forums. What do you think of this? Uh, do you think it's a good thing that each affiliation now has a viable way to have an archive portrait? Let us know. Um, one of the reasons why design is doing piecemeal sets, something for everyone, and more of the chunky sets where you have this Deep Space Nine chunk of the Klingon missions, or you've got uh, this other chunk of stuff, uh, so that they can give something to everyone and not just focusing in on these specific groups. With Colonel Worf, he's a bit more optimized when you're in the past Klingons, but don't be a slouch. He's got value outside that set. Uh, let us know what you think of it. Uh, the set will uh, release on Friday. Uh, thank you very much for listening, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.